Welcome back to another video and today we start at uh, Goit Valley in uh, Buxton, just outside Buxton and we're following it on all trails and it's the uh, the Irwood Hall walk and circular. Anyway we'll put it up on all trails so come with us and hopefully we'll have a great day. It's a little bit wet but anyway we'll carry on. Let's go. <laughs> If you have been here before, put it in the comments down below and let me know what's your favourite part of uh, the Goit Valley Irwood Hall trail because it runs over two reservoirs I think so just let me know in the chat below if you've been here before and what you think of it there's just so many lovely places I would say as well, come in the week try to come in the week if you can because I think at, uh, I think weekend, it's just uh, too busy for me. I prefer to do all the walks in the week if I can. If I can get out in the week, this is how I like to do it. I love to come in the week where it's a lot quieter and not as hassle. Because it's a lot of hassle when you try to film and uh, do some video work. There's nothing worse than so many people suffocating, uh, trying to, you know, obviously do what you do. So come in the week, it's a lot easier. I would definitely suggest it anyway. But I mean, look, wow. We've just jumped out of the car and so far I'm enjoying it. It's definitely uh, a lot of place this to give, definitely. Quite a contrast from how it once looked to today's sorry sight. Irwood Hall was built in 1843 by a Manchester businessman. It was used as a youth hostel for some years, but from the death of Mary Grimshaw in 1930 it was demolished in 1934. Irwood Hall was classed as the most romantic location in Derbyshire. Stunning views, amazing scenery. It's a wonderful place to explore, walking around the reservoirs, Fernley and Irwood. So we've just come over the bridge now and we've come across this tree. My God. Oh. We have never seen so many nests in one tree. I wonder what physically has drawn the birds to set up home here. Anyway, wow, that's just uh, unbelievable. And the size of them as well, they're absolutely huge. Some of them are really big. I mean, look at it, absolutely everywhere. How many homes would you say is here? <laughs> Quite a few, I'll say. Oh, that's different, isn't it? Anyway, we've had a good time here today, and I hope you have. I hope you've enjoyed the uh, video. Don't forget as well, we're giving you a compelling reason to uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. So uh, it would push the algorithm up for me, as it's not getting a lot of recognition at times. But anyway, I'll leave it entirely up to you. If you've enjoyed it, please comment down below. Don't forget to hit the like as well and leave us a comment. And we'll see you in the next video. <laughs>